15 year old boy is in the hospital tonight after police say another teen set his shorts on fire. Yeah, Butler County investigators say witnesses told them this was the result of bullying. Not on your side's Jason Law is live at our Butler and Warren County Bureau with the story. Jason. Investigators say they found a cigarette lighter that looked a lot like this one inside that mobile home. They said they've taken that lighter into into custody as evidence. Now, police say the boy was set on fire intentionally early Sunday morning inside a mobile home park called Countryside Trailer Park in Liberty Township. Nine on your side's camera was the only one rolling as two deputies with the Butler County Sheriff's Office knocked on 206 Ringling Avenue in Liberty Township. No one answered the door. Investigators already arrested a 17 year old who they say set another boy on fire. I just heard that he got burned when he was sleeping or something. Why? I don't know. If I knew, I'd tell you. Trenton Trice lives in this neighborhood and knows some of the boys involved. Investigators say several teens were hanging out inside this home. Detective Jeff Schuster said the 17 year old may have been bullying the 14 year old. That word was specifically used by the other juveniles that were in the residence. They spoke about the 17 year old suspect being at the house earlier that night, kind of pushing, slapping. It was enough for them to term it in their own words as being kind of a bully. Schuster says the boy was sleeping when his shorts were lit on fire and melted onto his body. Nylon running shorts and they don't, they burn quickly. And it's not so much a burn as it is a smolder and a melt. I mean, you could tell that they had kind of burnt for, for a good bit of time. The 14 year old suffered second and third degree burns on 10% of his body. He is expected to live. Now, we're not identifying the 17 year old who was arrested because at this point, he's only been charged as a juvenile. Investigators with Butler County Sheriff's Office do say they don't expect to charge anyone else. We're live tonight. Jason Law, not on your side.